The Morning Office for September 17th. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all His benefits. Protect me, O God, for I take refuge in you. I have said to the Lord, You are my Lord, my good above all others. I love you, O Lord, my strength. O Lord, my stronghold, my crag, and my haven. Purge me from my sin, and I shall be pure. Wash me, and I shall be clean indeed. The morning reading is taken from Matthew's Gospel, chapter 9, verses 9 through 13. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. As Jesus was walking on from there, he saw a man named Matthew sitting at the tax office, and he said to him, Follow me. And he got up and followed him. Now while he was at a table in the house, it happened that a number of tax collectors and sinners came to sit at the table with Jesus and his disciples. When the Pharisees saw this, they said to his disciples, Why does your master eat with tax collectors and sinners? When he heard this, he replied, It is not the healthy who need the doctor, but the sick. Go and learn the meaning of the words, Mercy is what pleases me, not sacrifice. And indeed, I came to call not the upright, but sinners. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Purge me from my sin, and I shall be pure. Wash me, and I shall be clean indeed. The morning psalm is read from Psalms chapter 119, verses 33 through 40. Teach me, O Lord, the way of your statutes, and I shall keep it to the end. Give me understanding, and I shall keep your law. I shall keep it with all my heart. Make me go in the path of your commandments, for that is my desire. Incline my heart to your decrees and not to unjust gain. Turn my eyes from watching what is worthless. Give me life in your ways. Fulfill your promise to your servant, which makes me to know those who fear you. Turn away the reproach which I dread, because your judgments are good. Behold, I long for your commandments, and your righteousness preserve my life. Purge me from my sin, and I shall be pure. Wash me, and I shall be clean indeed. O Lamb of God that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon me. O Lamb of God that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon me. O Lamb of God that takes away the sins of the world, grant me your peace. Our Father, who is in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Grant that I, Lord, may not be anxious about earthly things, but love things heavenly. And even now, while I am placed among things that are passing away, Hold fast to those that shall endure. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Lord God Almighty and everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin, nor be overcome by adversity. And all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose, through Jesus Christ my Lord. Amen.